Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to upgrade an existing Control Builder Plus project to Automation Builder 1.1. One could easily upgrade the project created in the previous editions of Control Builder Plus, like version 2.1, 2.2, .1, and 2.3. The first step is to create a project archive, if it wasn't already created. A project archive could be created either in the Control Builder Plus software, or in the Automation Builder 1.1 environment. In case of Automation Builder 1.1, the prerequisite is to have the previous version profiles installed beforehand. The next step is to open and extract the archive project into a selected folder using Automation Builder 1.1 profile. If required, the number of slots in the terminal base could be adjusted. For upgrade of projects containing relative path definitions, or links to additional files like libraries, or device description files, some additional steps are necessary, which is dealt in a separate video. Now, let us look at creating a project archive in the Control Builder Plus environment. Open the project in Control Builder Plus, in this case, the version 2.3 and create an archive containing all included project elements into the designated folder. The archive file has an extension like star.projectarchive. The second way of creating a project archive is via Automation Builder 1.1 itself. A double-click on the project file will launch Automation Builder 1.1. And the software detects that the project was originally created in Control Builder Plus 2.3. We need to select the option Control Builder Plus to open the project. Now the archive can be created and saved as shown in the screen. Now a double click on the archive file is launching the Automation Builder 1.1 application. And the Extract Project Archive dialog box appears. We could now extract the project archive and save it in a designated folder. Since the device descriptions of Automation Builder 1.1 are automatically linked to the project, the overwriting will not cause any error. The extracted project is now possible to be upgraded, with an option of a project backup. The project is now upgraded without errors and warnings, and could be saved. Now we could adapt the terminal base type in the first sub-project to the actual one. This concludes the project upgrade procedure, and any further modification to the project is possible. For further information and support, please be in touch with the contact details provided on the screen. Thank you for watching this video.